Quincy Simpson. Uh, Coach, thanks for your time. Thanks for taking time out of your day to join us here on the Selection Show. Hey, how you doing? Thanks for having me. I appreciate it. Doing good, Coach. Glad to have you on here. You know, we were just talking about uh, your matchup with, with Finley. Kind of surprised at the way that went. Um, is there something, and I, don't, and I don't want you to say that you're going to look in too far ahead, but is there something about you that is excited about the prospect of maybe getting another crack at the Trojans here in a week or so, or a couple weeks? You know, we, we don't, we don't, we have a matched up with Finley. We play the winner of Bowser and Madison, and Finley plays Springfield. So, you know, that we're a ways away. Now, if we both win, then obviously there'll be a matchup for the uh, district semis. Um, but right now, we still have four regular season games left, and then we have a tournament game to play. So I, I can't, I can't look that far ahead. That's something that I just don't do. Oh, that's that's fair enough, Coach. What are you looking forward to most as you have your matchups here in the last couple of weeks of the season? Is it more difficult to keep your kids uh, focused with the playoff seedings kind of being done, or uh, are you very much got them locked in on taking one game at a time? We are definitely going to be locked in one game at a time. Right now we have an opportunity to win our conference. Um, if we're able to win our last three uh, conference games, we win the conference, and that's been one of our goals. Uh, we're not even going to discuss uh, the playoff brackets as a team. Now, you know, some families and people in the community will, will mention things to me or my, or my team, which is quite natural, and that's okay. But as a, as a team, as a group, we won't even discuss the tournament until that time comes. You know, talk about the community. If I would say that your guys, your community, probably pretty excited. You guys have really added, um, a, you know, a lot of wins compared to where you guys were last year. Uh, what's the what's the feeling about how uh, how your late February and March could go, Coach? We control our own destiny. You know, we we spoke about these things uh, day in and day out. You know, um, we have a lot of games. Uh, coming up six games in 11 days. Uh, we got through two of them. This is going to be a, a big week for us. Uh, we got three games uh, this week, um, you know, and so hopefully we can, you know, we have to give these guys a day off today, and then hopefully we can have a really good hard practice tomorrow, uh, watch some film and get ready for our OG on Tuesday. Does it throw off your timing at all throughout the week to have three games in one week? Because, I mean, that's not something that you typically have to deal with when you're a coach. How do you make those adjustments to make sure your kids are uh, as close to 100% as possible when you're getting ready for those kind of things? Yeah, correct. You have to, uh, you have to make sure that we understand the kids need rest. Um, obviously, we're a north and south type team. We like to press a lot. We like to get up and down a lot. Um, and then we have to back off at times and trust our half-court defense. Um, we've done that. We've done that last night, and we've done that a, a little bit on Friday. Um, so, you know, you just got to pick and choose when guys, when you want to rest guys. Um, instead of playing nine guys, maybe stretch it to 11. Um, so, you know, at the end of the day, basketball and, and, and players are going to make plays. Lima Senior Head Coach Quincy Simpson. Coach Q, thanks for your time, and good luck in the playoffs. Hey, I appreciate you having me. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot, Coach. Well, much more to come on the postseason selection show. We check out the Ohio Northern bracket in Division Two, and coaches from Shawnee and Wapak will be with us here shortly in studio. Don't go anywhere on the postseason selection show here on WOSN.